All right, are y'all ready? Because it's here, the 100th episode. And I tried, y'all, I tried to avoid spoilers. But of course you can't. You can't avoid spoilers. It's not like the Miraculous fandom is kind about warning you for spoilers. You put spoiler warning in the, in the description of a post. Yeah, do you know what comes up first? The post, okay? Anyway, today we're going to react to this episode with French subs. So I do know that there's supposed to be, like, supposedly Adrian reveals his identity to Mari. Um, there's, he finds out about its dad, supposedly Gabriel gets the cat miraculous. Of course, this is what's from the trailer, and I haven't watched the trailers, but I've seen the comments of the trailer, and I've also seen people posting about it. Um, so, I don't really know how we're going to do all that in 20 minutes, because this is a 20 minute long show. Now, if this was a 40 minute long show, I could see how all of that could happen in an episode. But I don't have high hopes, like an ident identity reveal in season four after everything that's happened in season four. Yeah, that's a lot of stuff to happen back to back to back. So, like I said, I don't really believe that this is all going to happen or I don't know. But, I mean, I'm here. Let's watch it. Um, let's watch it and hope that we're not disappointed. Right, guys? Right? Please. Let's not be disappointed. Adrien, je suis ton père. Me fais-je bien comprendre? Oui, j'ai compris, père. Okay, the way he said, like, he said, like, dude, is Adrien a senti monster? Because, ah, because, like, they made a point to show him fiddling with the ring. Now, is he fiddling with the ring because he's sad? Or is he fiddling with the ring because he wants to control Adrien? That's the question. Hold on, where's Cat? Where's Cat? You need Cat. He's the one you need. You always need him. That's what the 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 the, the, the well, when their aspect appeared. That's what that showed you. Okay. So why is he not here? Dude, Ladybug's Lucky Charms keep giving her giant cars. She's 16. She can't drive. I mean, she can apparently. That's what. Glacier 2 showed us, but... Whoa! Dude, he can, like, shoot his shelter somewhere? Uh, that's new, because I thought he had to be like, Ta-ta! Then I go, boom, 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 boom. But apparently you can do shelter and they go, boom, 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 boom. You know? That's cool. Hold on. What? I'll forget about the conversation and you won't. Okay, but, like, Luca... So... In episode 16, Luca couldn't know who you were. But now in episode 22, he can? Why? What happened? What changed? Besides the fact that apparently you need to have the identity. But like, Luca's been akumatized multiple times. Multiple times. And Ladybug, you already know you can't get akumatized because you're a Ladybug, so if you were to get akumatized, uh, you would already lose everything. Like, you like you wouldn't be able to win. So why would you give Luca the possibility to learn Shaft's identity when he, first of all, has been akumatized multiple times, is on a permanent Miraculous holder, and, uh, like, he can get akumatized because he's not as important as Ladybug or Cat Noir. So why would you let Viperion know the identity when it makes more sense for you and Cat to just do the identity reveal because you both already can't be akumatized? Please. Seriously. Tout ira bien. But, like, he already knows. He already knows the identities. Mais alors, tu veux vraiment le faire maintenant? Exact. No, dude, dude, dude. Wow, c'est pas évident de se dévoiler à quelqu'un parce qu'on se demande ce que. I'm so sorry. I am processing. I'm just <sighs> because, like, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm processing. I'm processing because. She was like, oh no, we'll do it, but then like, mm, I ain't gonna do it, but then like, mm, 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 mm. Oh, Wait, not turning back now? What? Qu'est-ce qu'elle fait? 
suis amoureuse d'Adrien, mais je n'ai jamais aimé Chat Noir. You don't love Cat Noir? Yeah. Okay, first of all, that's completely false. You are in love with Adrian. I mean, Adrian and Cat Noir. I've seen Glaciator too, okay? He gave you an umbrella. It's straight up. You love him too. <laughs> I feel so bad for Plague because he's like, oh my god, Lady Bugabitch would have put this man out of his misery because look what I have to deal with. Okay, um, first of all, Rose sounds so much better in the French dub because <laughs> I can't stand Rose's voice in the English dub, um, but in the French dub, she's actually not that bad of a singer. I mean, I know it's like the same thing where she actually can't sing, but she sounds so much better to my ears. Um, uh, yes, he has discovered that because he saw, he knows your lady bad. Oh, lady, umbrella. Je suis, je suis prête cette fois. Are you really? Are you really? Dis quelque chose. Dude, I'm so confused. I'm so confused. Like, I don't trust the show to actually have this be a permanent reveal. I don't trust the show to not have to have this be a permanent reveal. And if they're gonna like backtrack on this, I'm going to be absolutely furious. Like, I'm going to be so mad. <laughs> no, no, I'm sorry. They ain't gonna actually make this official. They're not making this official. They're not. I'm sorry. I know they're not. I already know. He looks so depressed when he's with him. Oh my god. Look at this. It's already 14 minutes into this 21 minute long episode and they're just not getting this, so... <sighs> oh dear. No, because like, if this is the actual like reveal, the Ladybug and Cat Noir reveal is honestly, the way Ladybug reveal is kind of depressing and not really super fun because like we didn't like get a lot, I don't know. But then this, it's just, it's not going to actually be official. They're going to find a way to take it back. Oh dear God! No, I mean it's not happening. We already know this isn't going to happen. Éphémère. Me fais-je bien comprendre, fils? Holy crap! Adrian's a senti monster. Two times in one episode, they show that he's a senti monster. No way. Dude, too much is happening at once. He's a senti monster. Oh my god. Oh my god, he's a senti monster. Y'all, I am... Uh, 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 uh. Like, and we know it's true now. Cause, I mean, look at these subs. Look at these subs. Really? He's, what? Fighting the command? Oh my god. Look, he's like fighting the command. Oh my god, Adrian! <laughs> I'm so sorry, but like, dude, Adrian loves his dad so much, and this is showing that his dad doesn't actually like love him because he's just using Adrian to get whatever he wants. Um. So she just inadvertently told him that she's Ladybug. What the heck? <laughs> this is so chaotic. So this, it's too much. It's too much. And I'm going to be severely disappointed when this is not real. 
Mais moi, oui. Je peux revenir à n'importe quelle balise temporelle posée par le passé. Quand à quoi... Of course. Of course he can. Of course he can. Why would we not just make permanent stuff happen in the show? Why would we not do that? I mean, it's not like this is a, a well-beloved, well-developed, well super well-written TV show. I mean, like, no. Why would we have stuff happen and then stick to it? She had to eat the cheese. <laughs> Dude, look. Why Why are they so bad looking? First of all, that was hilarious. But. Ew, it looks so bad. It looks so bad. Why in the world? When did they stop making their transformations look good? Because they look horrible now. Ew. Of course, Ladybug gets a cooler one because she's the more beloved character. Like, she doesn't look weird, but she's flexing and she has nothing to flex. <laughs> Ew. You really shouldn't be having these important conversations in your ladybug suit on a balcony in Paris is like central area because the school is right across the street. You shouldn't be doing this. All right, look, this episode was, I wish I could do this on my good camera instead of the computer. The camera is on my laptop, so I apologize, but it's just like Wishmaker. Apparently, the episodes that are really good or really talk-worthy are the ones that my camera doesn't last the entire time for. Um, so, first of all, I knew when going into this that they weren't going to get to keep the memories of the identity reveal because I saw a spoiler for it right before I, start, I loaded up the episode. I saw a spoiler for it, so I knew the entire time that they were gonna there was gonna be some type of identity reveal and then we weren't they weren't it wasn't gonna go fully it wasn't gonna go fully and i'm extremely disappointed um i know that like it's just that every time they do a reveal that doesn't actually have promise or it like it's it's ta every time they do a reveal and it's taken back before the end of the episode it gives the real reveal less promise you know and if this was the first time they had done it and they hadn't done obliviate or you know any of the other possible times they could have had an identity reveal uh then it might have been okay, but they keep doing these identity reveals, and it just keeps taking away from the real i the real one. And I don't know when the real one's going to happen, when it's going to happen, no idea, what it's going to look like, no clue. And while this episode did give us a lot of stuff, like it, I mean, it officially confirmed that Adrian is a sentient monster, there is now no way to deny that he's not, as far as the fact that it hasn't officially been said, but the fact that Gabriel twisted the ring whenever he wanted Adrian to do something, Adrian's a sentient monster, and the fact that his father is just using him is very, very, very sad, and I feel so, so, so bad for him. But I'm disappointed in this episode. I, I mean, it was fun to watch, but the fact that the identities were revealed and not, like, held true was just not good. It wasn't good. Mm -mm, I don't like it, no. Um, so, those are my opinions on the episode. What are your opinions on the episode? Please tell me in the comment section um, because I don't know. I mean, first of all, too much happened. Like, they could have made this like a two-parter, but apparently they only decide to make two-parters for the finales. I don't know why they never do them before then, but they don't. Um, it's just, yeah, I don't know. I guess, is it too much to ask that Miraculous have good writing? <laughs> 
<laughs> is that too much to ask? Because I'm pretty sure it is. But anyway, those are my opinions. Tell me what y'all thought in the comments below. Did you like the episode? Did you hate it? I thought it was a. F I liked the episode. I just I don't like what happened. I I don't know. I don't know. It's hard to explain. Maybe I'll make a whole video on it one day. I don't know. But I mean, this is great for my Adrian and Gabriel AMV that I really want to make, but I don't want to make it until I have all season four's episodes. So yeah, I promise I will be making edits of Miraculous as soon as I uh, get all the episodes out. And as soon as Gabriel Grass comes out, I will have one coming out for that. So anyway, Thanks for watching. I love you all. Hope to see you guys all next time. And hey, don't forget I'm still a freaking bulldozer. Bye, everyone. Yeah. <laughs> Doesn't really work that well, does it?